Hello there, Big Benedict here. We're playing Gears of War Judgment, and this is my three stars declassified insane difficulty guide and walkthrough. We're currently on Act 1-5. It is entitled The Cash Cure Wing. On this one, the declassified is going to uh, make the normal drones switch out for the Cyclops drones. They're the ones that use uh, Lancers. They could also use Bulltox, but on this mission, I think they just use uh, the former. And the... The drones themselves have less HP, but their weapons are faster, and they uh, they need to reload less than the ones that use the hammer burst because of the clip size of their weapon. And um, this is not that bad. It's a little strange though because on, uh, on declassified, there's a turret at the end of this hall. See the turret on this side. Um, that that only gets put here on declassified so that is uh, the change that you'll notice if you go over there and the next thing that I like to do uh, once I take care of most of that right uh, hand side of the room is I'll run back here uh, pick up a boom shield and uh, uh, stake my claim right here as it were as I like to say sometimes jokingly um, you can use the boom shield to uh, deflect the chainsaw attacks from the drones um, but it usually doesn't come to that although the drones do charge at the end so you'll want to be careful of that and uh, when you do get back to this side try to get a headshot on the turret guy at the end through his visor uh, on the other side you can do the same with the the one behind the turret but there's a lot of going on over there a lot to get killed by so you'll need to be especially careful of that and uh, you'll know that the fight is coming to an end though when you see the guys charging at the end and then down on this area over to the right actually there's another door through which uh, some wretches will spawn near the end of the of the actual uh, second phase and those those ones can just be uh, killed by by laying proximity mines down some of them and uh, you can also use the turret as I'll show you over here in a moment but um, there is also an onyx box on the right side of the room near about to where I'm aiming actually so you can refill your your um, your boom shot if you do come here with a boom shot and uh, this should be the point at which we get some runners coming over here it's a little um, it's a little dangerous uh, to not look around as much as I'm looking around here but I do know that they are coming and we have a boom shield here which should protect us a little bit from any uh, charges although if they're at a full sprint I think they can kick open or sorry kick over the boom shield and then come after you so you want to be careful of that and also just careful in general of any uh, chainsaw attacks that come from uh, these enemies and it's a pretty decent place to stand over here hold up in this room once it's clear though you're gonna push to the end of the uh, of the hall on this side and then you'll have some more enemies uh, shooting up from the ground I really like how they retain that from uh, Gears 3 uh, the shooting up out of the ground of the enemies um, and then you'll you'll be um, dealing with more that come through uh, two uh, two doors in a moment so I believe now we're getting rushed so yeah this is the point at which we, we, we're getting rushed over here so uh, be careful stand behind uh, some cover and try to uh, bait them over to you and you'll get execution uh, point points for executing enemies Okay, so um, now you can either uh, rush uh, the last area from this side or the other side. I'm going to put a grenade down here because I know that's the door through which those uh, wretches will come out. And again, if you're not playing to classified, uh, you're not going to see this this turret over here. Over here. So it's... Um, it's a little easier actually on the classified because you have that turret. There's the onyx box right there, by the way. So I'd like to take this boom shield, I'm sorry, this boom shot out of this stage into the next one. Uh, there's, uh, there's us here going up these stairs now, and what you want to do is 
uh, cross over the tripwire point. There's the door being uh, kicked open and the grenade detonating. And then um, you can get behind the turret and get some gib, uh, gib point kills. Or I guess gib kill points would be better. Um, but the, um, the, uh, the turret itself can be gone into first, first person mode and uh, you can blind fire through it as well. So there's usually only three enemies that you'll have to deal with as far as those wretches are concerned. And then the last thing you're going to deal with uh, is this door opening here and a mauler coming through. I really detest the maulers but just because of how, uh, how easily they go into their defense mode. Uh, but they do have a, that sl really slow walk, so I guess it's hard to complain. It's just that it's very difficult to shoot around there. Uh, their boom shield so I'm gonna come back here pick up the long shot and uh, and then we'll go over here and exit out of the room through this uh, this doorway over here and then we'll uh, we'll take a look at our our score sheet here we got all the stars as, uh, as you know of course and then here are my statistics and I'll let you as I say peruse those at your own leisure and until we get to the sixth chapter of Act 1, I would ask that you would please take care. I hope the walkthrough is helping, and again, please take care.